Hello everybody, my name is Mathis and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. Alright, so we've got four wins under our belt. It's not bad. It's no, it's by no means a win streak, but it isn't bad, and I'm happy to have it. It's, it's a great start. So we're gonna start with Tractor Beam, Book of Shadows, a three Spirit Hearts, and decent damage. Alright, this is a good start. Now, if- oh, fuck you. If there was a weakness to this starting run, it would be the lack of, I think, Red hearts that we can use later on to say, um, you, for deal, deal with the devil, uh, fuel. But that can be fixed after the first boss fight or even the item room if the item room ends up being something more, uh, akin to a health upgrade in some way. You know, the usual. Uh, for now, of course, we're gonna walk into a room and is it not only is it not double, uh, and it's not envy. Um, yeah, envy, sorry. Not only is it just regular envy, it's double regular envy, so that's always fun. Love when the game decides and wants to switch things up and toss me uh, for a loop that I haven't gone on before. I don't think I've ever come into a room and there was double regular envy on basement, or even burning basement one. Maybe I'm wrong, um, but I feel like that's the case. I feel like we have not really seen it. Tractor Beam is going to be one of those situations where it's a, it's a sneaky damage up. Um, and the reason I say that is because it, it basically increases my accuracy. Uh, and higher accuracy means fewer missed shots, and fewer missed shots means more damage to enemies. So, overall, you know, we're in a, we're in a good position. Um, our damage is, is, you know, of course, a troll bomb. Uh, not only is our damage, you know, slightly above average for starting, uh, but we're getting something that is deceptively more powerful than it actually is. Uh, by giving us that, that higher accuracy. Uh, so next time you see this wonderful item, don't shit on it, because it's actually... P good, fam. Uh, 100, 100, and uh, all that. Ooh. Now, is it worth the risk? It. I mean, it's hard for me to say no, it wasn't worth the risk because I didn't get hit. But had, if I had known that was the Hermit card, I guess would I, would I have risked that? And I feel like the answer to that question is no, probably not. Um, but you never know unless you try. You never know what you're gonna get. So um, it was it was worth it for me, in some regard, just because. Hey, man, you never know. Could have been something awesome like um, the hero font. All right, we need to find the item room. That's what. Oh, we'll come back for that penny. Uh, that's what we're looking for right now. And of course, another big ass room. We have no bombs. I would like to get some bombs dropped too. I heard a key drop, but it's probably behind some rocks that I can't. Yep, there it is. Ooh, but we got a key dropping right there. And it was only a golden key, and the golden key doesn't count. Yo, Basement XL. Oh, that changes so much. I didn't realize we're on Basement XL. Well, first of all, it makes me proud to have played as well as I have. Um, but it also means our deal with the devil is going to be on this floor. Which is interesting. Hmm. It's weird, because I've had two runs in a row where I've started super powerful, and I just got immediately more powerful, so... Ooh. <laughs> Do I give up Book of Shadows for that? Hmm. It's a tough call. Because I don't know what the answer is. To redo this floor, probably. But is it worth giving up Book of Shadows? I don't know. I'm gonna think on this while we go fight the boss. Uh, check out our secret room. Cursed Eye can suck it, basically. Hell no. Super secret room has... Uh, an, uh, an uh, Yeah, a room worth doing, basically, is what I was trying to say there. Do not get hit. Oh, my God. I hate this shit. Alright, well, we got hit, which makes doing the curse room a little bit sketchier. Uh, unless we get something really good. Hmm. Let's move this down. Alright. Man. Unfortunate draws left and right there. Um, was hoping for a spirit heart or something. Let's go fight our boss. We'll see what ends up happening. Our boss is. Monstro is the first boss. Is, is real good. That's going to help me out pretty big time. Um, hopefully we end up getting a damage up or a health up. Uh, maybe I would prefer a health up. Our fly as does not want anything to do with Monstro at all. Dude does not want at all, there we go, to go and attack him. Can't blame him. Let's get rid of that, get some corner dodging in available. 
Okay, he's gonna be dead on this landing here. Uh, Magic Scab is great. That is a really, really good pickup for us. Uh, the luck up that comes with it is obviously great, as well as the health up that we can hopefully trade away on this particular boss run, or this particular boss fight, rather. And our damage is good enough where Little Horn, he's not really a pain in the ass in general, but he's less of a pain in the ass this time around because we're, we're kind of just tearing his shit up. And again, I'm curious how much of that is attributed to the fact that uh, Tractor, Tractor Beam is actually helping us out here with our accuracy. Jesus Juice is totally fine. It's a damage up. Who? Um, I think I have to take the book. Um, you know, if it wasn't, do I do? Do I do it? Why don't we go in on half a Spirit Heart and teleport out? I could have used the Hermit card and taken no damage by using Book of Shadows first, then Hermit carding out. Which would have been the smarter decision. But I'm losing half a spirit heart here. So we do that. And of course we come across restock, which is super good. But I can't afford it. We're going down to the next floor. Basically I'm losing... Uh, oh, no. You know... Oh, fuck. Forget me now. I think I leave forget me now. And I take Book of Belial. I think Book of Belial is an objectively better item for us to pick up and take with us in the long run. The damage up that comes along with it, as well as uh, increased chances of deal with the devils. It's just better. Again, it's tough. It's real tough to say that that's the case, but that's what my heart and soul are feeling. Uh, that's just how I feel. Okay, well, let's do this. Uh, it's not... Now, the thing is here, it's not Flooded Depths. Or the Flooded Caves, or whatever they end up calling it. Which is really good for us, because Flooded... The Flooded Caves are just a pain in the ass. And I don't want to deal with it. However, the first room has some of the more flooded... Op the more obnoxious flooded enemies. Uh, the, this, this, that particular floor has to offer. And I need to get rid of the spawner. Real bad. So if we could get rid of the spawner, that would be ideal. I hit him with two two dark poops in hopes of doing that sooner, but it didn't quite work out that way. A battery is nice. But not particularly useful for me at this moment. My leg has been man, there we go. I keep pausing because I'm like, my leg is so itchy. And I couldn't get the I couldn't hit like the right spot. But no, we're good now. Curse of the blind. That's a shame. So unless I have any red hearts, the chance of me picking up uh, a deal with the devil, if we get one on this floor, which is low, 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 low percentage, but the chance of getting one, or picking it up rather, are minimal. Sure. I feel like I should use this more. I don't use it enough. It's probably correct. Come on. Can I please kill off one of you? Thank you. Alright. Still, it's like, it's good, but it doesn't, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't guarantee that we're going to be taking a deal with the devil. This room fucking sucks. And a golden, golden bombs are great if we come across... Tinted rocks or whatever. We can just open everything. This this room is a, a waking nightmare from hell. I feel like I'm stuck. Can't wake up. Wake me up and son. Won't wake up. Meh, 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 meh. Okay. Well, if I do this, then I can turn around real quick and just basically hit him with a bullet, which is why I was doing that. I felt smart. I felt smart. Alright, you know what? This room sucks, too. We're just gonna start dropping some dank bombs. Alright, well, I'm just gonna fuck it up completely. I just need to clear some freaking space. Didn't work out for me at all, but that's how I felt. So we took a one hit. Ooh, possibly two. 
Should have taken two. Didn't take two. But it is what it is. Oh, this is a great room, actually, for us. Yeah, please. Yes. Oh, God. Don't ever do that again, Mathis. That just felt wrong. Like, you ever do something, you, you say something, you're like, no, man, that did not even feel like right. That's about where I stand on, on what it felt like making that noise, of course, because that's just how it is. I don't know why I avoid the regular fires. I shouldn't. I have golden bombs. I can just pop a freaking bomb. And it wouldn't it wouldn't even count towards my bombs. Why wasn't I doing that in the first place? I mean, I can't even think of a good reason, man. And I should be blowing up all the uh, fuck off. I should be blowing up all the mushrooms. Okay, don't get hit by the champion though. That's like rule number one for me right now. Okay, freaking guys with the eyes, go down, please. Just give me my item room, man. That's all I want. Well, give me magic mush, something. That doesn't help. Hopefully, Monkey's Paw will come in in the clutch for us and hook us up with some heals if we end up needing it. Power pills is fine. Doesn't really do much. I'd rather have something that doesn't do much than something that hurts us. We're going to the shop. No question on that one. This is going to be tough. We're going to pop this and we're going to do it. I need one key. Just need one key to show up. And it will be 100% worth it for me. Or we could just pick up an item. Now that could be Bob's Bob's head, Bob's brain, something essentially useless for me. Have we even gone to the item room yet? No. We gotta save this key, man. I gotta go to the shop, maybe even buy a key. But I can't open this last one, not yet. I have too much money. Let's see what this ends up being. It's Guppy's head. Hmm. That's a tough one. All right. Restock. We buy two keys. The Joker card guarantees us a little something something. I'm gonna drop in a few pennies here. Bring up, bring us up to a hundred. Um. Here we're gonna bomb you. Didn't happen. Uh, we'll pop this open. We got a key back. Hmm. Fireworks are going off outside my house. Fourth of July weekend and all that. Hmm. 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 An interesting situation we find ourselves in. Still, Joker card is great. Restock is great. We can definitely use restock. Didn't wasn't restock on the last floor? Just it wanted to be here. We got it cheaper by waiting a floor. Charm of the Vampire is borderline useless. Is where I would put that the value of that item right now. Hmm. All right, let's go fight our boss. We'll make a decision what we're gonna do after that. Okay, well, we might just die. Okay, let's not die. We're gonna go ahead and drop some sweet, sweet bombs. Uh, that's unfortunate for me. Monkey's paw gonna help me out, I think. Okay. Thank you. Good enough. Come on. Okay. Matchbook. We then have to say no to the Joker card right now. We cannot use it. We gotta go down to the next floor. I gotta go. I don't know, was that the right call? Hmm. Yeah, I mean, we don't have a choice. All right, fuck it, let's go. Charm of the Vampire, not a good pickup. You know what, for two really... All right, we gotta not do that ever again. 
for two really powerful runs in a row like we had this is all right i'm fine oh this sucks okay we we somehow fucking pulled that one out of our asshole i don't know how we didn't get hit we deserve to be hit there but we didn't so that's good for me i need to kill you Ugh, was there a curse on this floor no Addicted is fine, because it's not going to do anything, because I waited to the end of the room to take it, which is exactly what you need to do with pills if you're going to take them at all. Now, Guppy's head over over Book of Belial's, and also a pretty interesting choice, I must admit. Because Book of Belial, I think, arguably is more valuable than Guppy's head, but Guppy's head is more reliable for damage, but Book of Belial helps with deals with the devil, or helps attain them. But right now, we're not really in a position where we can just kind of go gung-ho gung on picking up deals of the devil. Ooh, hoo, hoo, almost walked on the spikes there. That's going to be a problem, probably. Can we please just kill you? One more. Now, secret rooms have not been terrible for us. So x-ray goggles have been a nice first pickup. More money is great because we have restock and all kinds of goodies. Ha <laughs> Nightlight, 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 nightlight. I mean, it's not great, but hey, it could be good. <laughs> uh, all right. That's what you want to give me. That's what you want to give me, I guess. Let's go fight our boss. Spider mod isn't great either, but I was kind of banking on it paying out there after. I don't know. Let's go fight our boss. We'll make a decision. Oh, okay. Well, we got a little chat already, though, which is funny um, because it means that we're at least going to get something different here. You know what? This sucks. That was poor bomb placement. No idea if that was better or worse for us. We have so many bombs, it doesn't really matter all that much. Do not get hit right now. I, give me a health upgrade, man. That's what I need right now. That's like kind of a health upgrade, but not really. You know what? All the times we're going to fight Krampus, now is the best time for us. For obvious reasons. We have zero opportunity to give up health to pick up a deal. So to pick it up right, to, to fight him now is perfect. Okay, we can't be getting hit, though. I already got hit once. We'll be fine. We'll get through this fight no problem, but... And we have a Joker card, which means since this doesn't give us any more Deal with the Devil precedence, and we might not get one on the next floor, uh, we can still force one if we need to. Uh, I'm so nervous right now, because I can't, like I said, I can't really afford to be getting smacked around. I guess we'll just move on. I don't like moving on, but I'm going to do it, because I don't want to be on this floor anymore. Curse of the Blind, again, is pretty fucking bad. Lots of consumables is super good. Okay, let's just be careful. The charm shots are good, or the, the charm status effect is nice. It's not super valuable, but it's nice. Okay, stay far away from me so my, dam my shit does more damage to you. Spider mod, thanks for at least, you know, throwing out a status effect here and there. It's appreciated. And that's fine. Totally acceptable. Oh. Yeah, let's go in here. More bombs is good. And ah, we have 16 bombs. That's actually really good for the situation because it means I can hunt for uh, maybe some beautiful uh, spirit hearts out of those blue fires, man. Now, he's about to charge. Yeah, he got frozen right before he was going to charge. Just had to say that out loud so I knew to move out the way of his trajectory. Eh, this is a shitty room for me. But we took out a champion with the bomb fly, which is good. Sometimes I think I hit enemies and it shows damage being done, but then I don't see the health bar going down. That throws me off, man. I don't like that shit. You know what? You first. Hoping for a demon heart or something out of the skulls. I don't have infinite bombs right now, but I have enough where I can play with them. 
And the flies are doing great. I would kill for just like something to survive, uh, solve our survivability problem at this point. Anything to just like fix the fact that we are running low on health. Kind of as like as it's been since the start of the at the start of the game. We've really not had a chance to be above four-ish hearts. Okay. And I'd like to, like I said, change that if possible. Please and thank you. I'm going to hang on to Monkey's Paw because it's going to give me a little bit more opportunity to survive. Okay. Yeah, this room is a shitty place for people who need to dodge like me. See, his health bar didn't go down. Or maybe there was two health bars there. Because they were two separate entities, I guess. Yeah, no. Don't even think about it. You see that shit, you just walk in and you fucking just do it. I don't think it's going to help me. Because if I can fly, it's the only way that's going to fix anything. Okay. Curse the blind again. Right. Scatter bombs. Um... It's about where I stand on that, I guess. Um, it's not ideal. The fool. We have 19 cents, so the shop definitely is something we're going to be popping in into there. No question. So let's go do that and hope for something real good. Seven cents. I'll take it. Ah. Uh, do I just go hard here for a little bit? Ooh, ooh, oh god, okay. There was scatter bombs and I completely forgot about that. So let's be careful here. We'll pick up one more thing. Champion Bell, you know, I'm alright with that. Could be better, could be worse. It's valuable. That's what I'm looking for right now. Like I said, a little bit more survivability would be real nice. And if survivability comes in the form of just plopping out bombs everywhere looking for spirit arts, so be it. So be it. Now the question is, do I force a deal with the devil if we don't get one? If I get a health upgrade or not? Do I just kind of let it, let it go? I still have this joker card. I could hang on to this Oh, no, I can't. Um, this is depths one. I was going to say, maybe we could hang on to it and end up using it for... Uh, like getting out of boss rush, but we're nowhere near boss rush right now by any stretch Okay, this is gonna fucking suck Uh, I mean it doesn't really matter does it? Fuck Okay, that also was an unfortunate turn of events, but it worked out Just bounce Bounce, 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 bounce. Come on. That didn't do, do fucking nearly as much damage as I feel like it should have. Since all the cluster bombs hit. Okay, he's healing now. I don't get it. You see his little health bar bounce up there for a second? Because I sure did. Uh, rotten meat. So we... Should force it and take whatever this is. Satanic Bible. Cambian Conception. Uh, I gotta take Satanic Bible. I don't have a choice there. Um. I'm gonna go back for that battery. Cambian Conception is not gonna do jack shit for me. But Satanic Bible is what I was asking for in the fact that it is survivability. Now, granted, I'm not going to get the damage from Guppy's head anymore, which is, you know, another real tough loss for me. But this is worth it. So this is going to give me more spirit hearts. Because I only have spirit hearts right now. And that's actually really, really huge. I can't, give, I can't afford to give you keys. I wish I could. But... That's big. That's real big. And I'm happy that that happened. Uh, so it goes to show, you should absolutely always check arcades, regardless of the situation. Okay. 
We're doing a good job. I'm going to just pop this now. Because I'm not going to be able to find my way back if I get lost. Ah, uh, cluster bombs almost fucked me. And all of a sudden, our health situation has fixed itself. Ain't that fucking wonderful. Alright, well, I, sh I say that and I just lose immediately some of it. It's fine. I'm alright with it. This is fine as well. I am looking for the item room and the shop. Okay. Why don't we do this? Um, somehow that did not hit him. That's weird. We're a full up though. Justice will pop. Wheel of Fortune is not worth it. Okay. Mongo baby. All right. Whew. Run is sorted, everybody. We've won. Pack it in. Can't get any better than that. Except, you know, when you actually can. Well. An unfortunate draw, Mongo baby is. Not that you know Mongo Baby ain't bad, he's one of the better of the familiars, in my opinion. But it could be much better. We're not looking good on the guppy item front either right now. Okay. Fish head, I'd rather hang on to the, the last ditch effort of survivability. Why don't we do this for money? I would love to go to uh, the shop. Wanted to make sure that we there was, in fact, no other option that way. So let's go back this way. And down, maybe? Nope. Left? Left. Works for me. There go my Bracano flies. Two keys for that many bombs with the amount of keys that we have. Yeah. Can't say no to a deal like that. Come on down to Mathis' Emporium! Can't say no to a deal like that since 1972! We didn't talk like this back in 1972, but it's fun! Whew. I think my AC turned itself off or something. I'm sweating in my room right now. Don't know why, don't know what's causing it, but I am actually breaking out in a freaking sweat. Okay. You fucking... Oh, I'm taking damage here. What'd you want me to do? Not one of those uh, damn things decided to turn around. I'll take the High Priestess. I think this is the mom fight, but we can use it on the next floor. Can't high priestess mom. But. Ooh, this could be good. Rune Town, USA. Okay, let's see. Algiz. Algiz. Burkano. Blank rune, which is Dagaz, which is great. Another Dagaz rune. Yeah, I'll hang on to Dagaz. Alright, well. Still nowhere, th we're not in the right area quite yet, but we've got to be getting close. This room effing is a nightmare, but it's all right. Yep. Every time. It's just par for the course. We have no more shops, so fuck it. For the bombs, yo, for the bombs. I'm going to blow you up to get rid of you. See what you dropped for me. Eh. To get the key back is nice. It's not, you know, immaculate or, like, incredible or anything, but it's good enough. I'm sorry? Oh, the eyeball? Is that what got me there? It must have been. Nothing else makes sense. Alright, I am ready, man. Hook me up. Give me uh, a deal with the devil that is, like, Worth taking. I've been waiting for so goddamn long. This run has just like been steady as she goes this whole time. Uh, that's unfortunate. That that is what ended up getting. Oh god, fuck it, I'll take it. I'll take it. I don't like it, but I'll take it. Two more opportunities, man. Two more opportunities. For some uh, some deal with the devil shenanigans, I'm really I'm hoping 
I'm, I'm super hoping and praying. I'll blow you up. I need something. The item rooms do not carry me. So I need a little bit more help than what I've got. Oh, fuck this room. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. This room sucks just as what well, just as much. Ah, oh, good times. We can still do this. This is fine. We're nowhere near like the end of our rope here. All right, it finally hit. Got caught on a rock for a split second, but it worked. Just gotta maintain not taking any damage, and heal up with uh our wonderful. Satanic Bible. There's so many champions in here, but that's just because... <sighs> that's just because we have ourselves a champion's belt. I'm gonna take the, the occasional poison tears, I think, here. Okay. There's another battery there, which is good, because I can heal up. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Let's see what this card is. Hermit is a nice teleportation card, but I'm trying to think what I would want to teleport away from at this point. I'm sure as fuck not fighting the Hush. Like, we're not even- we're barely good enough to, to beat the bosses that we're supposed to be beating to beat the game. Hush is nowhere near what we- where our, our power capabilities right now. This room is also not worth my time, so I'm just gonna leave it. Sorry. To disappoint. But no way. Okay, do not- there we go. Say, so do not get caught in a bad position and get fucking hit by one of the beams. We didn't. We're good. Yeah, some money there that I can't really touch. <sighs> That's fine. At least we're, we have permanent Polaroid invincibility. And that is a huge pickup for us. Also, I should go check what's in that mob trap, boss trap room, whatever it ends up being. Yeah, it's fine. Keep getting hit, Mathis. Just keep saying it's fine, because if you just say it's fine enough... You'll accept it. More fucking money. You know what? Nah. The Hermit card otherwise is not useless. Useful. It's more or less useless is what I was getting at. Death. So, an orbital, I guess, is... Got its uses on... I guess, I guess it's useful in a way? I'm trying to think? Like, yeah? Deal with the devil. Very useful. If two guppy items popped up, it could be game changing. But unfortunately, it was just health. Fuck, man. Alright, whoa, fuck. One more chance to deal with the devil, then we gotta go through the game with current base damage. Basically use Bob's brain to carry us, I guess, in a weird way. And, uh, you know, pray that we're gonna make it. And I don't like having to rely on, uh, fucking hopes and prayers, man. I'll tell you that much. It's not how I want to roll. We need damage. Um, but if we can get through the cathedral, obviously we have four more chests that we can maybe use, uh, to get some items. And I only say maybe because there's an opportunity that it just won't pay out. Like, they just won't give me good items. But Bob's brain, and you know what? Even Cube of Meat is good enough to say I'm confident that we have a chance to get at least past the chest because we have permanent polaroid invincibility and with permanent polaroid invincibility we have the opportunity oh, get me the fuck out of this room you know what at this point let me finish it now because i want the extra charge i took a hit i want the extra charge man ho oh, can be in conception paid out that is with a really good familiar oh okay thank god that is it it's not a game winning familiar but it's good enough where i feel renewed Hope that we're gonna be able to pull it out. Always pull it out. Unless you like you know, you're going for like a family and stuff. Then then you don't. I mean, uh, you just just saying, be safe, kids. Because be, be safe. Now that that method is, is particularly safe, uh, I always, you know, use more protection than just that, but you know what I'm saying? Like just be careful, man. Just don't don't be dumb. That's all. I don't know why I did that when I know I couldn't get to it, because I can't fly. Alright, 
This sucks. Get me out of here. <laughs> I would like to be on the other side where the spirit heart is. Where the grass is green. And the girls are pretty. One makes me larger? Shit, son, I didn't need that. It's kind of already a... I'm already unmanageably large as it is, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm you know what I'm saying. I, at least three of you know what I'm saying. Okay. Not that I've only been with three people, god damn it. And that that they're watching what I'm what I'm not that they're watching these videos. God what no. God, I'm an idiot. As in I don't know what I'm saying until after I say it. Um, I will take the lemon party pill. And just go boop. It's not gonna help, but we'll do it anyway. I think it I think it did something. Get in there, Bob's brain. Enjoy yourself. Have fun. You know, have a little party on the mom's house. At mom's house. Oh, oh, okay. Well, that's what happens when you go the wrong way. Deal with the devil. Fuck! Alrighty. Well, I'm gonna feel like we at least earned this win if we walk away with it. I am gonna feel like we earned it. Not that I don't earn wins, you know, normally, but this one in particular is gonna feel relatively well earned. Because it's just been, it's just been a very average run. And relied pretty heavily on just good gameplay to get me this far. Which is ideal. That's what you want. You want it to rely purely on good gameplay. That right there, not what I would call good gameplay. Um, still, I'm just saying for the most part it has relied on good gameplay. Ah, oh, fuck off. Alright, well we're going in. We're going in hard on this one. Kill off you guys. We're good. Good, good, good. That's fine. It's really the greeds that throw me off. And this is just not the right way, which is a shame. Because I thought it would be. Eh. Eh, if there's a Yara. Oh, if there's a Yara in here. Oh, f I'm going to be feeling real good. Yara. There's two Yaras. How nice is that? Burkano. Blank Rune. Dude, I don't know what that did. Alright, that's what I was looking for. We take the Yara. We answers our way to victory. We just go to the Isaac fight. We we fight our butts off. We Yara the shit out of all the chests, and we're in a good we're in a good position, man. I'm feeling more and more confident. I mean, I, I stopped feeling not. I stopped feeling not confident when we uh, we got Satanic Bible. But there are moments where I'm just like, ah, oh, man, if we could just, you know, we just need a little damage and I'll, I'll feel real good about it. We don't really have that, but we have a better chance at it on the next floor. Again, I don't deserve it. We got two runs that were basically gifts the past couple episodes, and you should watch them, man. That's, that's what a gift from God looks like in physical form. If you don't believe in miracles, you will after watching those episodes, but still. Oh, Bob's brain is going to be hitting like a truck, too, which is awesome. That is really, really good. Okay. Why don't we get in there? Alright, I don't think the scatter bombs end up picking up, like, the, the damage that we are putting out. Like, the extra damage. But we're in phase three. We took a few hits, but honestly, they're manageable. And after this, we're going to get one of those hits back. So I'm fine with it. And as long as we can keep him teleporting around like that, we're in a good we're in a good position. Well, that was uh, my mistake. I thought he would be teleported away by then, so I got close, expecting to move and dodge, but that was my own fault. Do not get close. Bob's brain is gonna hit real fucking hard. Okay, Yara time, baby. Here we go. Fingers crossed. Shit. Great. <clears throat> um. Eh. Alright. This is an overhaul. An overall great haul. I'm gonna take Magic Mush because it's just a good pickup. We'll see what this ends up being. 
We have 2020. Um, not picking up Unicorn Stump because it's not super valuable to me. I don't know what our Zodiac sign. Oh, it's got it's Poison Tears. Uh, so yeah, that's fine. Will that stack on itself? I don't think it does. But it would be hilarious if it did. 2020 is not showing, and that's it's freaking throwing me off. I don't know why it's not not showing. It just isn't. That's you know I guess fine. I know we have 2020, and I'm assuming the tiers are just stacked on top. Oh, it's because we have Tractor Beam. So yeah, they're stacked on top of each other. I had to say it out loud for it to like register for some reason. Tractor Beam helping out. I think we've got this. I think this this is that it, that was exactly the haul we needed. It was an overpowering haul, but it was enough to carry us to victory, which is ideal. It's what you want. Okay, well, there's a hit right there. An unfortunate hit. Hit nonetheless. But we're gonna do this. Oh, shit, yeah. Take this. Come down here. I just wanna hedge our bets and really kind of make sure. Oh, shit, son. We're good, we're good. Beautiful. Okay. Good. I'll at least take a look in here. If that was going to be a guppy item, I was going to laugh. It wouldn't have made us guppy, but it would have brought us tantalizingly close. Sometimes all I want is just to be tantalized, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes anybody, all anybody wants is to be teased and tantalized. Nope. There's the boss fight. Perfect. Alright, let's end this. No big deal. Or as the kids say, <clears throat> NBD. Get it in there. Come on, Bob's brain. We have not taken a hit yet. That's about to change, I was going to say, with the, the way those flies were going, but it still worked out nicely. Yeah, that's going to be another win. Win five for us. Thank you guys so much for watching. That was a fun one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did come back next time, more Binding of Isaac Afterbirth, consider dropping a like. Your support means the world to me. And as always, I'll see all of you next time. Bye-bye.